Makenji critiques from Makenji Dick Rise of Favorite Anime. Welcome to a double live reaction. Yu Kusho episode 71 and 72. A lot of you guys are really excited for this. Before I fucking start, I just need to get this off my fucking head, man. Like, you know, I don't make rant videos, dedicated rant videos. They're more in rages, but they're, they're more broad topics, right? I read the dumbest fucking comment today, man. Dumbest fucking comment. I think it was on Kizum. <clears throat> The Kizomonogatari 3 film live reaction, right? The Kizomonogatari films came out. There was a three-part movie series. And on the third film, someone commented recently. And he, he must have listened to one of my uh, my views on Kiss Shot, right? The the vampire woman, maiden, whatever the fuck, right? He goes, and then he brambled all about my thoughts on Kiss Shot or something. Then he goes, you're not very good at judging character. You're the guy that said Gintoki is an evil, manipulative bastard. And I quote, he said, I said, that Gintoki is an evil, manipulative bastard. I'm like, what is wrong with people, man? You know, people have a reading age. Like a reading age. So no matter what age you are, you've got a reading age in your head, right? People need a fucking listening, listening fucking age. You know, some of the anime, any, any, any Twitter or anime community are like Robocop. Someone fucking asking Robocop, what is the meaning of love? And they're like, processing, processing. Inconclusive. Like... What is love? Processing, processing, inconclusive. So that because it's inconclusive, they just they just say what they thought you said rather than what you actually said. I've never called Gintoki an evil, manipulative bastard. Would that be something I would say about Gintoki? Now I know some people are salty that I don't have Gintoki in my top ten characters of Gintama, but someone, even someone like King Recon, who's like the biggest hype boy for Gintama, goes, I can understand how you would have. 10 characters above Gintoki that you like more. Simple. That's enough. But let's forget that for a second, man. The only thing I ever said about Gintoki is he knows how to manipulate people to do the right thing. But amongst all the banter and the jokes, when he has a serious conversation with someone, he's kind of cheeky. He knows how to manipulate people into doing the right thing, right? Appeals to their better nature, right? That's why I said. I didn't call him an evil, manipulative bastard. You're not very good at judging character. You call Gintoki evil, manipulative buff. I'm like, just fucking... Just take a break from anime for fucking a week or two. Get some work or go go out go on a summer vacation or take a trip somewhere or play tennis or do something. Like, seriously. Alright, so we are on episode 71. <clears throat> I'm definitely gonna be singing the the open uh, closing three. I'm definitely gonna be singing. You know, I forgot last time, and I have to tell you guys: never underestimate insomnia. Never fucking underestimate, especially for you guys about to do exams or studying or revising. When you have fucking two, three months of fucking insomnia, you forget things. Like half an hour, you told yourself you're definitely gonna do this. You fucking forget. You even forget things fucking within seconds, right? You, like I say, I met, I did use one example. When you're praying, right, you do the, the ritual watching, right? You're supposed to do it three times. You forget that you fucking did it this, this, the third time. So you're like, did I do it the third time? Or right, let me do it the fourth. Little things you fucking forget, man. So never underestimate a lack of sleep. Sleep is not for the... Sleep is... People who say sleep is for the weak. You don't know what you're saying, man, till it's too late. So let's get to this. Yu Kusho episode 71. Come on. I'm just going to make sure I fucking remember... As soon as that episode closed, close my eyes for the preview. Fucking straight into that closing three. I've got the lyrics up as well. I hope by the time it that closing finishes, I, I know it off my heart. Like I know the intro. In a crowd, in a faceless town, I need to feel the touch of a friend. In the countryside, wonder far and wide, the isolation gets me again. I don't know where to go when I feel like crying. Oh my, it's time to open myself, do something new. I want to stop and grow up a bit. They refuse to show Genka in this small form now in this intro, I noticed. Now that we've seen it once, like they don't, they, they don't want to show it in the intro. Everyone needs to look a bit older, right? Or more weathered or seasoned. Intuition and my wisdom grow. And then I know. Most of all I sense compassion's real. Thanks to strangers wherever I go. Thank you for waking me up. 
Oh, there he is. Little shit. Still. Four dimensions. This is apparently an exposition dump, which Sagashi is either good or bad at. <laughs> I knew it was Genkai. I called it. I literally called it like 15 minutes before. So this is a... Uh, Saki's plan, but revived from the dead. <laughs> hmm. He wants fucking... Kiyama to come, man. Slip through. They found 1,000 fucking black holes around the... Uh, around the Milky Way, I think? Or the center of the Milky Way? I read that news today from PBS. Imagine shit coming through that, man. Shit got dark. She's gonna get dark now. Taka. Fucking OJ. So the, right now the holes are big enough that the bugs have come through, right? Small, but they're probably gonna get bigger and so more of them can get through, right? Makes sense. And you know what this reminds me of? Stephen King's The Mist. The Mist. Fuck yeah, no. Giyama's coming, man. Nobody knows. All fucking hell breaks loose on Earth, man. <laughs> you know, someone take that picture of the baby on the... Take that baby on the beach with the fist and make it look like him. <laughs> Someone do that, man. <laughs> Bloody hell. Somebody's forcing it. Giyama is coming for these guys, man. Scheduled. Scheduled apocalypses. What the fuck? <laughs> Border town between Soul Society and Karakura town. Hmm. Mushiori City. <laughs> yeah, bond this compartmentalization bullshit. Yes, yes. That's a good thing, isn't it? If they got a good character. Oh wow, fuck it. Yeah. That's it man, Gogma Gog coming.
A is probably Ifrit level, man. Them fucking gins, man. What? You just be that. I love that. That's how you show people's power. You just you just diminish what came before. You're like B class fuck. <laughs> Course, yeah, infinite fucking seven levels of Jahannam, man. <laughs> yeah. Wow. What keeps them all chill down there, man? S class. I love it. S class. That's such a Japanese thing, man. They just sat their asses on it, man. Yeah. Kakai Barrier. Mm. Okay. B class still get through. Ah. Uh, I see, because it's almost like a real net, right? Slug can get through, but bear can't. No, but you can handle them, all right? That's the thing. Fucking, oh my God. <laughs> Fuck here, yeah, no. Oh my God, that, that does look like that. Fuck here, yeah, no. That's fucking, that's like fucking Kiyama coming on Earth, man. Gog Mogog coming out, the butt alert, the butt alert, fucking. <laughs> Fucking everyone up. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. It's so simple. He explained it. He explained it in pictures and diagrams and everything, Belen. <laughs> But how, what's the population like? A couple of S-class guys, a couple of A guys, trillion B guys. If a trillion Bs come, you're done. You're done, man, unless you got more fucking... At least at the same time, you're creating people with powers that can at least fight back, right? Interesting. Interesting. Fucking... This would be like an army, man. Army of, like, people on the side of the spirit detectives and some on this guy's side, the demon side. Legit, this just feels like one of those old R-rated anime films, man, that you should just watch. <laughs> what was that fucking anime with giant tentacle cocks were coming out of the ground and shit and just killing them? How was that kind of... Turn to Resident Evil. Fucking, this is my, my boy, man. One of my favorite characters. Is he just a head? Yeah. Sensui. That's a Naruto fucking soundbite. Everybody stand up. Wow. Fuck it, he's just a head floating in a fucking fish tank. Pissed. <laughs> Judgment, innit? Kiyama, innit? Kiyama coming.
Omar, get out of my coming. Who is this guy Sensui? Is he related to Sakyo? Or is he something else entirely? Fucking, huh? Judgment time. What is My man's doing Shakespeare right now on stage. He is doing Shakespeare. Fucking giant monologue, isn't it? That's crazy. This hype me for this album, man. Kaito. <laughs> he done fucked up. I don't know why he wouldn't have the power to undo his own power. You get what I'm saying? Like, it worked again. I mean, I understand why it works against him. He's probably new to this shit. Like, a few months, he said. <laughs> hmm. Oh, shit. Is that foreshadowing? True, true. Kaito. Shadow. Nice. Yeah. It wasn't on, put on hold, man, that fucking plan. Wow. Three weeks. Fuck it. All hell breaks loose. That's crazy. This is gonna be epic. Oh, Sensui. Mushiori. Like Pacific Rim, man. Them kaijus. Better explanation than Pacific Rim. That's so cocky, he thinks he can fucking. A threat he's never even fucking come across, he can. <laughs> you should have picked a lady. Exactly. He is gonna lose. That's why he's gonna have to have to get the fucking eyes, man. Yeah. Oh. -oh. Be in it, he's probably. 
It be. I knew it. I knew his middle would be. See, I guess right, man. I knew he was strong, man. But Quran was pretty damn strong himself. <coughs> bees, B can take on the bees coming through. Nobody believes you, man. You say that and you come back. Yeah. <laughs> First time I agreed to call Barra. First time. <laughs> you know, he is Zesif <laughs> in Tesh. Leaves comes back, leaves comes back. <laughs> yeah. Okay, it's B in it. B's a B, man. Fuck it. <laughs> What's King Koenma? I know there's no demon class for him, but still. Does, doesn't Kurama technically rank as a demon? As well. Technically. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I wanna I wanna see the mix up a bit. Nice Steven. He had to leave to make it symmetrical. Special pillow mask. <laughs> Bone tone. Where's your girl at, Yukino? <clears throat> Time for the edge lords. What the fuck is this guy? He's a psychic. He's a psychic, right? Okay, he wants to make sure the SNAs come through. Hmm. What's, what's this guy's origin, man? Judgment time. Oh shit, this, these are his mans. <clears throat> They're the shadows right now. What are you going to contribute to this, Keiko? <laughs> look, look, look at him. Does he take dumps as well? He's scared. Oh, man. <laughs> what good is Pooh anyway? What good is he in this form? I know he senses really well, but I'm sure he's got a transformation. Pooh can just flies anywhere, man. What if a game hunter, a clay pigeon, shoot it, bang, fucking shoots the guy? Poor little shit. I don't know, they live that close to each other. Maybe that's why I have Kurobara and thing hooked up with yeah. I like the fact that they changed the colors to match the lighting. You know, a lot of animes forget to do that. So that in, in that top she's wearing might not actually even be pink. It's just the lighting that they have to make it look like there's a different lighting, right? 
could be a blue top for Lena. Fuck, hey, look at him. They all stuck in the shadows, man. Tagashi loves that. He did that with the. I want to say he did that with fucking um, the troop, Phantom Troop. I I I gotta. I'm gonna do the outro. I'm gonna I'm gonna do the outro. Da -da -da. I'm gonna sing the outro now. I remembered. I remembered my my fucking song didn't get to me. Who's he gonna get to slash blah blah blah? That's all he talks about. How am I gonna punch this motherfucker in the face, man? Alright. Then a broken mirror. I can see your reflection. Tears roll down your face. Tears roll down your face. Your finger trace the edge of the new moon. Who is that I'm calling now to? I can see you walk away from me Time and time again Time and time again You will find me knocking on your door With my back Pressed against the weight of the world And the speed of the night It felt as if a thread was snapping in two And I held on to you, held on to you, held on to you with all my mind. Here we go. As you share an unbalanced kiss with me, I hope you can feel less getting closer to love. And may your fear and your tear, full of deception, both come to rest in my heart. Oh, my love. Fucking great. It's fucking tune, man. Fucking tune. Fucking tune. Alright, next one. Bastards. Not you guys. <laughs> Fucking do it. Fucking let's go. That is hype. I'm getting hype for this art. They just promised you something there. They just promised you something in that fucking art. That, that was a good exposition dump as well. Not late. I swear Tagashi got worse in that regard. He kind of was chill with the exp exposition dummy. He didn't need to have Kurapika sit down and explain to him that this ring does this, gone, this ring does that, but I have to do this and that. It was just explained by a character who normally would do the explaining. You know, it's just kind of, in it's, it's a, in well, it's a it was a convenient time for him to explain all this elaborate thing that they're sitting their asses on top of a demon world, which goes to all the way down, right? Like, they could have told him earlier, right? It's always at the right time they tell him. And then fucking Unameshi's going, Where the fuck do you tell me this soda? And then they just point him in the direction of some demon and just fucking take the leash off and he just beats the shit out. All right, let's go, man. So <laughs> fucking hell, man. Fucking bastards. <laughs> you Kusho episode 72. Come on. Learn to chill myself out, man. Man, this is fucking dunya, man. This world. We call it dunya, right? The world. What a shit place. And why do you think the whole fucking population wants to escape? Why do you think we're so obsessed with nostalgia and escapism, man? It's like anything but to have to live in this world, man. Anything but to do it. We all feel it in our souls, man. We're atheists, religious, fucking Buddhist, whatever. You'll feel there's something fucking wrong in the world, man. That the world just doesn't... Con you're not content in the world, man. That's where depression comes from, man. you got to elevate your fucking consciousness. I'll tell you that, peeps. My air and confidence are swelling up. Magically erupt. I wish my power and confidence fucking magically erupted, man. I don't even... See, this te song is teaching you, man. Fucking show kindness, man, to a stranger. Greet strangers, man, with kindness, man. Say good words and shit. You never know, man. You could make a guy's day, man. Stranger saying some kind words to someone who's fucking suicidal. You never know, man. Make you make his day. Thank you for waking me up. The internet just encourages people to become hateful edge lords, man. Let's go. Let's go. I like this. I like the demons and fucking like fucking Jandam coming for these fuckers, man. <laughs>
<laughs> what a mess she's gonna turn into devil man. <laughs> what a mess she's gonna turn into devil man. The only thing people are equal in is death. The only thing people are equal in is death. It's true, though. It's true. <clears throat> You open that third eye, man. <laughs> this is remind me of a fucked up version of a Ghibli film. You don't see him. Hmm. How does someone that looks and dresses like Genkai walk around like that? Like will dress the way she's dressed. She looks like she's dressed from fucking feudal era Japan or some shit. I like the threads. And I love it it's isolated to just the city, not the world. Okay. Underground, yeah, it's that guy. Or what about in the sky? <laughs> Most of these port portals look like they were coming from the red sky there, man. R28. <laughs> You're the guy with the spirit detection power. Yeah. <laughs> you bellered. Nothing gets past you, Kobar. Oh my days. This is one of his fucking minions, man. Since we's minions. Shit. <laughs> now you get that fun. What the fuck? Yeah, man, if a scumbag fucking rapist develops a power, man, imagine. Legit, this is like fucking <laughs> the, the divide that'll happen on Earth, man. On fucking world ends. What the fuck is going on? What about the girl? Get cut, I don't know. Why is everyone such a slick Rick, man? Everywhere you go, slick Rick. Fucking Italian fucking shoes. <laughs> Sounds like Crispin Freeman. No. It is Crispin Freeman, young Crispin Freeman. I always see changed. What's your shadow shit gonna do, man? Uh -huh. Is it smash the lights? What the fuck? 
territory. Okay. The territory in which he can manipulate the shadows. Yeah. Ah, nice. I like it. So he's a mind reader. Oh, <laughs> fuck it up. Bloody hell, he got punished. It's like Street Fighter. You fucking miss your, your special, yeah? You get punished. <laughs> Mind reader. Policia. <laughs> you just did, you bellow. No, no. <laughs> Boxer. Smart. Yeah, but you ain't got the fucking strength that they have. You'll be dodging for the rest of your life. Ducking and diving. Got very powerful power now. I think about it. <laughs> when the fucking new skin starts dressing so slick, <laughs> school holidays, man. Fucking shit scared there. No commentators now, nah, man. It depends on how quickly his brain can can register what he has to do. Yeah, but he, he won't see the. Yeah, and his spirit energy. Yeah, but spirit energy is gonna come out. He's gonna let that spirit gun shit out. The spirit energy is gonna have a radius a lot bigger than his where he stops though. His radius, come on. Yeah, see, it didn't touch him. It's the spirit fucking energy, man. He can channel that shit. Remember, before, like he was learning. His hitbox is big. It's like a beat up. Oh shit! Shockwave, nice. Something like Taguro would do, man. I always wondered, like, uh, Gona is when he transformed versus a Vorgan, right? They had similar nan abilities, right? A Vorgan and, and uh, Gon. Who would win in that fight, right? I always wondered. Now I wonder who would win. Yusuke in his prime or Toguro. I mean, he already beat him. I know what I mean, but still. It just reminded me of Gon versus Vorgan. My power. <laughs> nice. Hulkamania. Nice. I like this. I like this. Ayame. Ayame looks like a uh, dress like a um, thing's sister. Do you know what? A brother, sister, some people, we differ on that. It's brother, right? Kill was brother. 
dressed as the fucking kimono girl. It looks like a legit. She's dressed in. Kill your sister or brother, because it's, it's a trap character. She, he is right. Yeah, the dress in Kill was sister or brother, whichever. Man, I don't give a fuck, man. It's Chinese, man. It looks like her. You need to get some tips from Professor X, man. Somewhere between rage and serenity. Somewhere between rage and serenity. I love he's got a tissue in his nose. He need he needs cerebro. The weed room. I she, she changed the codes. Don't the police find this weird? She looks innocent. Oh. <laughs> no matter <to. laughs> My man's taking orders, man. He has got the most powerful. The copy is a very powerful ability. He can fool the whole chain of command and shit, man. Of the, the enemy. <laughs> but then they got psychics on their side, so they can read the minds. Don't know. It's almost like he's telling them. I'll kill them all. Fuck it. Huh? He sees the plan, man. I'm guessing his psychic, the other guy's psychic, has realized. It's reminds me of X-Men. <laughs> Slip back. Fucking. Oh, shit. Shit. Shh. You brought and brawl this motherfucker in there. Oh, my God. Look at that. Look at that grin. Look at that troll grin. Fuck it, now I deconfrost shit. Blood, you you got an innocent guy killed because you embroiled him. He's probably got mum and fucking dad and sister, brother, fucking family, man. That's it, man. Fucking Kiyama's coming for these guys. Someone's gonna die in this arc. I thought someone was gonna die in the last arc and they did. They, they, they copped out. What? What? Man, the consequences need to be here. Oh. Pencil? This guy is way more powerful than fucking Toguro. Bloody hell. I thought he took one right there, man. Fucking brain. Right, that fuck, he's alive, man. I would have lost a bit of respect for these guys dragging him into this. Fuck it, these bugs are fucked. Yo, you ain't got spirit powers. <laughs> K 
cake, full cake on man, so it wasn't a dog. Don't wear your pretty little ass. Just look after your boy, man. Poo your boy. They're not gonna be able to fucking chase an ambulance on foot, man. This is man's a Jurassic Park and that chick running around in high heels all over the place. Oh shit. My man. What is this? This guy stepped out of Akira. Canada just stepped up. Maybe he's Jew. Bindi on his head. Seven graves. I like how he refers to it. All the dirt shall become graves. Fucking, it's all. My man's so fucking apocalyptic, man. That's what I'm talking about. Shit. Sniper, come here. Oh wow. He's gonna kill seven those those people. Seven graves. Yeah. But he wants him though, he's psychic. Shit. <laughs> nice. Of course. When's that stopped you before? The first time you met fucking Toguro, you were chill. Whoa, is he a demon or some shit? Oh, that's a good description. Shit, man. Talk to you motherfucker. Fucking hell. His forehead's gonna open up to be something, man. Watch. Hold on. You what? The sniper must have. The sniper then, that they're talking about. Okay. So it was a sniper. Oh, the guy, okay, the guy on the roof. It's fucking Canada from Akira who did it. I guess he took, I think this is meant to be like like uh, Akira, the movie. Apocalyptic, almost. Oh man, fucking epilepsy. Man. Fuck yeah. Everybody stand up. They're all gonna have to fucking stand up now. Yeah! Why'd you drag this motherfucker into, into, into this? Hey, what the fuck? Who's this? Another one of his fucking minions. This is the doctor. This is the doctor. Look at him. He's in the lab coat. That's the doctor. Doctor and the sniper we got. I like that image. Judgment time. Fucking judgment time. That is crazy. That is fucking crit. 
All right, I'm I'm gonna listen to what he's saying, but I'm gonna sing it. I can listen to what she say. I don't want to see what they say. I knew Doctor was. I just predicted it's fine, man. I forget. I, I knew that was the doctor in the lab coat. Lab. Okay, I'm not gonna listen. Predator. Well, what the fuck? She's she's basically describing everything. I can just barely make it out. Predator in the hospital. Okay, I can't hear it. Blah blah blah. With a now good mirror, I can see your reflection. Tears roll down your face. Tears roll down your face as your finger traced the edge of the new moon. Who is it that I'm calling out to? I can see you walk away from me Time and time again Time and time again You will find me knocking on your door With my back pressed against the weight of the world And the speed of the night It felt as if a thread was snapping into And I held onto you, held onto you, held onto you With all my mind Beat drops. As you share an unbalanced kiss with me, I hope you can feel us getting closer to love. And may your fear and your tearful deception both come to rest in my heart. Oh my love. Fucking greatness. You, you, now I'm calling you bastards. <laughs> Seriously. Fucking sing, man. Sing. Sing. <laughs> fucking Mad Max. <laughs> Alright, people. Thank you guys for watching, man. Hope you guys enjoyed that reaction. As much as I fucking enjoyed watching. I'm fucking hyped. This this arc has started more hype than anything. The, the, the Dark Total Mark was very slow going in the beginning, man. This is just like fucking greatness. I'm so hyped at, at the, what's to come. With the promises. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Twitter. Those details are below. My backup channel is below. Fucking go subscribe there if you like my reactions. My Discord server is below. Fucking join it. It works now. You can talk about you, Kusho, LOTGH, and all that fucking good shit. All that anime weep shit, whatever you want to talk about. Peace out, guys.